Welcome back. If you're new here, my name is Preston and I'm a master barber with over 11 years experience. On this channel, I do haircut tutorials, vlogs with information that is pertinent to our industry and product reviews. If you're interested in being the best barber you can be, consider subscribing. In this video, I give step-by-step -step instructions on how to do a high taper. You will see some clipper over comb work on the taper just to fine tune it. There's also some beard work on this particular client. His front hairline is receding, so we don't want to emphasize that too much. So stick around and see how I handle that. Stay tuned. All right, guys, here we go. We are doing a three and three quarter debulk in the whole head, just bringing everything down to that level. And right here, I'm starting my first guideline for my back taper with my Andis Slimline Pros. I love these edgers. These are my Wall Senior Cordless with a beveled blade open. This is not the blade that come on the seniors. Um, I put a beveled blade on it as you can see right there. But um, this is open. And I'm just working my way down um, lever play just blending that out and this is a one guard open And it's lever play, just working my way down. This is the half guard, and I'm still playing with the lever. And a two guard open. If you notice how I, I, I'm constantly flicking out, it's just a habit. This is a one and a half guard open and I just play with the lever working my way down. And then the one guard open, I'm just coming back to this guard just to detail my work.
you can do this whole taper with a clipper um, just your blade and then the comb um, honestly it's faster to do it with the you know the the shorter part of the taper with with guards but you can do it with a comb and, and clipper and here's the edge I really like my slimline pros my Andis slimline pros I really like these edgers And I don't have them zero gapped. I feel comfortable using these on anyone. Kids, it doesn't matter. I These aren't going to hurt anyone. So, And you can see they cut a pretty crispy line. And here I put my first guideline in for the side taper and I round it. And my seniors open to for my next guideline. And once I get the guideline in, I start the lever play where I just work my way down, blending it out. And my one guard open. Same thing, once I get the uh, the, guy, the next guideline in I just work my way back down fading it down to the to my previous work the half guard you can see right there where I just done you know I was closing the lever you just gotta play with the lever guys it's magical what you can do with that and some clipper over comb right there just tidying that that taper up I like to use clipper over comb on the top side the longer side of these tapers because I have a guard on both sides or excuse me a guide on both sides and I can just work my way right it's easier it's faster for me And I start the, the blend for the the beard, working my way down. Well, it's back up, but I just start to blend there. And this is the other side. Put my rainbow shaped first guideline in. These are my seniors open. same steps um, what you do to one side you have to do to the other this is my one guard open putting my next um, uh, guideline in and it's just lever play working my way down here's the half and the scissor or, or excuse me the clipper over comb work I start blending the beard down
and the edge. These trimmers are not zero gapped and you can see they cut a really nice line. Just doing the front hairline. I end up doing, um, I don't want to say end up, but I do color enhancement on this guy's front hairline just to give it a fuller look. And I'm going to do the, the lower, below the beard, the neckline, and then I'll come back with a razor. That is Sherry you see in the background. She's the girl that works at the shop with me. We have a lot of fun at the shop. And this is the haircut. If you like it, please give me a, a thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks for watching.